Breaking news coming in. Pakistan has taken on the Indian government for the application of Article 370 at the United Nations General Assembly. Pakistan Prime Minister Shabazz Sharif calls it a plot to change the demography of the region. Calling itself a victim of terror, Pakistan says it's a victim of terror spread from India, even citing the hijab debate to say Muslims are oppressed in India. In a classic settler colonial project, India is seeking to turn the Muslim majority Jammu and Kashmir into a Hindu territory through illegal demographic changes. Millions of fake domicile certificates have been issued to non-Kashmiris. Kashmiri land and properties are being seized. Electoral districts have been gerrymandered and over two and a half million non-Kashmiri illegal voters fraudulently registered. I'm joined by my colleague Abhishek on the broadcast. Abhishek, so a new Prime Minister of Pakistan but the same old script. Okay, so it was a very much on the expected line. Uh, we know that uh, Shabazz Sharif has got this chance to address the world and obviously the, his Pakistan domestic audience as well where uh, he was expected to do some uh, this adventure regarding Kashmir and he has done it. He has raised the issue of Kashmir uh, and everything uh, that has happened in Kashmir over the last three years uh, and called out Indian uh, Indian state for all the so-called operation that he has termed and persecution of Kashmiris and the kind of uh, total uh, demographic that India is trying to change. So this is how he has tried to accuse India for all the trouble in Kashmir. And he has also called uh, for the long-standing peace. We need to understand each other. India and Pakistan need to understand each other and... Uh, get away from the war mentality so that the prosperity can flourish on both the sides. So that that statement, that part of the statement while well, uh, holds the valid, uh, but with the kind of narrative and the propaganda he has tried to create on the issue of Kashmir, uh, we are expecting that Indian side would be giving a very sharp reply to uh, Sharif's statement uh, and address at the United Nations General Assembly. And uh, most likely, Indian diplomats will be uh, delivering a right to reply, right of reply, a uh, few hours from now, where they will be tearing apart the statement and all the accusation that Sharif has tried to put on Indian side. Right. Thank you, Abhishek, for joining us on the broadcast and decoding.